Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back to our channel. In case if you are new to this channel, means please subscribe to our channel. Well, now in this video, I am going to share you how to lock or unlock or how to enable or disable whole keyboard in your PC or laptop. So once you enable or disable or lock or unlock the whole keyboard, means you can't able to use any keys. So, so that is the important thing of this feature. First of all, I am going to share you how to do that in the Windows 11 operating system, and after that, I'll share you how to do that in the Windows 10 operating system. So you can able to do that uh, using the option called filter keys so normally when you're actually cleaning or something like that once you actually press and hold the shift key for eight seconds like that it will actually activate the filter keys so once the filter key is actually activated means so you can't able to type any other keys like that there might be a misbehave on typing the keys and so using that option you can able to enable or disable or lock and unlock the whole keyboard so for that first of all in the windows 11 based operating system so first of all you need to go to the settings option and under that you have to go to the accessibility option and that just to go down and click on the option called the keyboard so once you go to this option so here is the option called filter keys just to click on that so whenever if you are uh, click on the filter keys so just to click on that uh, enable this option so once you enable this filter keys so in the windows 11 operating system there is a separate options here so once you click on the filter keys so you will see a three different option so normally if you enable the filter keys means it's actually good thing only because it will actually protect your keys on so multiple uh, repeated keystrokes or repeated uh, same num same keys pressing on repeated times like that so for that only the filter keys is actually given so for example i've actually turned on the filter keys keys now i am just uh, uh, typing a, a key so i am pressing n and so for single time whenever i am pressing like this it will actually works so in case if i press and hold this n button means so it will not actually work because the filter key is in the on condition so and once i am actually turn off the filter keys so if i turn off the filter keys so now if i press the n key continuously so I am just to press the N key, press and holding. So now the key is actually working continuously. So for this purpose only the filter key is actually given. So once you enabled, so you can't able to uh, type a key repeatedly or continuously like that. You can type any keys by single stroke like that. You can't able to do the press and hold option and in case if you want to lock hold the keys in the keyboard or enable or disable like that so for that once you enable the filter keys just click on the option and here is the option called ignore quick keystrokes low keys like that option so you have to enable this option by default this option has been disabled you have to enable that option once you enable that option so for now you can't able to use any keys so for example even your win key will also not work so i am just pressing the windows key so after pressing windows key also so the keyboard whole keyboard will not work so as you seen here so it will not work so i am continuously typing nothing has been typing in the notepad so this is the way you can easily enable or disable or lock or unlock the whole keyboard in your windows 11 based laptop or pc and i'll show you how to do that in the windows 10 as well as so once you turn off this option again so now you can able to do any process so i am just typing and i am just uh, clicking on the windows key so windows key is actually working so this is the way you can easily lock or unlock the whole keyboard or else you can lock or unlock a windows key like that so for all this purpose you can able to do that using this filter keys option so this is the windows 11 based uh, setting option and for windows 10 the settings will actually differ so let me show you how to do that so in case if you are using a windows 10 based laptop or a pc like that means so just head into the settings option and there go to the option called ease to access so this option is to access so under the ease to access option so just to click on the option called the keyboard so here it is so once you click on the keyboard option and here is a list of option and now here just to enable the option filter keys so after you enabling the filter keys now here is the three option so you can just turn on this options so all these three option once you've done that so the whole keyboard will not works it will be locked or disabled like that and in case if you want to enable or uh, again uh, unlock means you want to just turn off all these three option 
and uh, after the turn off the filter keys and in case if you feel like uh, so that might be a disturbance like that means you can just uh, untick this option allow the shortcut key to stop the filter keys so this is the main reason it will be activated uh, frequently so once you turn off this option means so even if you are actually accidentally pressing the shift key continuously also means so the filter key will not be enabled and your keyboard will be always in the working condition so you will not face any trouble so this is the only way to protect from filter keys enabling automatically this is the same thing for the windows 11 based also so in case if you are in your, using a your windows 11 based means here is the option keyboard shortcut for filter keys so once you turn off this option means so even if you are pressing a shift key so if you are accidentally press and hold the shift key for eight seconds also means so the filter keys will not be turned on automatically so you will not face the issues like keyboard is not working or a keys are not typing like that issues so for that you have to just disable this option so then you can easily able to uh, able to use your uh, keys so in case if you want to lock the whole keyboard or uh, the enable or disable the whole keyboard means just to go to the option uh, accessibility keyboard filter keys and uh, under the accessibility keyboard just to turn on the filter keys option and after that under the filter key option just to enable this ignore quick uh, keystroke slow keys so once you turn on this so the whole keyboard will be locked so no one can able to use your keyboard and that's a good thing so in case if you want to so lock the lock your whole keyboard means it's a good option and in case if you want to unlock means again go to the same settings just to turn off this one and that's it so so now you can able to use all these things so for example so like that you can able to type so this is the only way you can able to unlock or lock or enable or disable the whole keyboard so well now that's it for today video guys and hopefully if you guys like this video hit the like button and if you are new to this channel means please subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching this video guys